my vlog oh my gosh this feels so weird it feels so weird this is long overdue but what's up y'all so as you can see by the title this is the day in the life of a full-time entrepreneur however this is my last day of work so technically I'm not a full-time entrepreneur yet but I wanted to take you guys with me my last day but I have to wake up by 5 30 to get to work by 8 and like my body does not like that it wants to wake up naturally on its own but now I can do that because I'm a full-time entrepreneur after today I'm so excited because I get to do what I want to do what I've been wanting to do but yeah so today we're just gonna go through what my day looks like at work the job that I'm leaving yes I'm a full-time entrepreneur. Hey YouTube, so I just want to show y'all how much of a hassle it is to get to work. This is why I'm so happy today's my last day. Like I was cruising and driving and I was singing like eh. you know, you know when it's your last day or something and you're in a really, really good mood. Like that's me. Like I had to park mad far today. I drive an hour and a half to get to work. And then I drive around for like 30 minutes looking for street parking like do y'all get my struggle who wants to do this I'm so happy today's my last day anyways it is 7 37 I woke up at 5 30 that's two hours two hours to get ready and get here and I'm still not at work because I still gotta walk so it's my last day I'm so excited, y'all don't even understand. Like, oh my gosh. I can't wait. I'm probably gonna put like a little clip of me doing my last minute work before I leave. Um, I do work in a hospital, so y'all are not getting no whole vlog in the hospital. Like, no, can't do that. But I can do a little clip of me in my office doing some work. So I'll probably insert that, but I'm leaving. <laughs> let me, let me start walking. Let me go walk. It's cold outside. It's literally freezing. It's freezing. Anyways, I'm gonna go walk to work and I will catch y'all when I get there. I'm at work y'all and it's giving last day chronicles. But, anyways, yeah, I'm at work. I'm at work. This is my little workstation. And I can't really record much because my job is very intense. I work in the hospital, but I deal with certain victims, and we're just not going to record that. But after this, I am no longer a woman working for somebody else. I'm a woman working for herself. I'm so happy. I'm so happy, y'all. Anyways, let me leave because I'm doing too much. You're doing a little too much. All right, bye. Oh my gosh, y'all. So I'm trying to like wrap up stuff or whatever. And I look at my work phone and one of my clients sends me the sweetest message ever. Like, this is the perfect way to end my last day. Like, look at this. This is so sweet. When you put kindness, love, all of that out in the world, it always returns, I promise. Like, it always returns. That literally made my day. That made my day. I'm entrepreneur gifts. I won't let no one come and take your place. Cause the love you give, you can't be replaced. See, no one else, let me let you do. 
That's why I'm mine. Spend my life with you. I wanna please you anywhere I can. I wanna share my world. Don't you understand? Welcome to a day in the life of a full-time entrepreneur. I know I look a little tired. I'm looking a little crazy. My hair's not done. Um, but I'm just going to package some orders with you guys. So you can go through the process with me. Um, so these right here, these journals already have the thank you cards and the stickers in them. But we do have to put them in these ones. Then we have to package them, print the shipping labels, ship them off. And I plan on doing all of this now, getting dressed for the gym, heading to the gym, working out. Um, I'm probably going to bring these to the post office either before or after the gym. And then we're just going to get some work done today so you guys get a little look into what life is like as a full-time entrepreneur. But let's go package these orders. I'm looking at all my orders. I'm about to print the shipping labels and get this thing started. there to package our orders okay so we had to switch locations because i needed more space but basically what i do after i print my shipping labels and my what is this thing called what is this thing called i don't even remember what this thing is called but it basically tells you your orders and your shipping labels so once I do that, I basically lay out all of my shipping, packaging, and based off of the quantity that people ordered, I'll put the, however many journals they got, their thing, that list, what they bought, and then also their, why am I drawing a blank on the names? What is this called? I don't know, but... The girls that get it, get it, and the girls that don't, don't.
now that I laid out everything with the shipping labels and the, I, I'm gonna figure out what it's called. I'm literally gonna, hold on, give me a second. Oh my gosh, I know what it's called now. So I put all the shipping labels and the packing slips. I don't understand why I could not get that. Like I was getting so mad. Anyways, I put all the shipping labels and the packing slips on everybody's packages. So now I'm gonna put the packing slips in the bag with the journals and then just put them in our shipping. <sighs> our bubble mailers and get ready to ship them off y'all i really don't know where my head is at today like i really need to go to the gym so that i can just get my mental together Hey y'all, so all of my orders are packaged. So and now I'm gonna go get dressed to get ready to go to the gym. I'll probably eat something small. I'm not really a breakfast person. Um, I'm also gonna pack my clothes that I'm wearing later because I'm going to Lifetime so I can shower there, get dressed there, and then we're gonna get some work done later after we ship off these orders. Hey y'all, so I'm dressed and I'm ready to go to the gym. I have a lot of bags with me right now. One, I have the stuff to ship you guys as items. Two, I have my work stuff to do some work after the gym. And three, I have some clothes to change into. So. We're gonna get going, we got a long day ahead of us, but I can't wait to take you guys with me, so let's go. Hey y'all, so I'm with my man, we're at the gym. I got a lot going on, I'm trying to make this Instagram post of my beautiful customers who bought my journals i was about to say planners i had planners but i sold out my journals um so we're about to go into the gym work out we just came from the post office i'll insert some footage i probably already inserted some footage why is the lighting like that look what as i was saying we just came back from the post office and I shipped off my orders, he shipped off his orders, he has a business too. And we're about to go work out and then do some business stuff later. I'm hungry, he's hungry, we both didn't eat so I don't even know, like, I don't know. Do y'all be going to the gym and you don't eat because we do it all the time. But we're at light time so we're about to go work out and I'll post some clips of me working out. And yeah, I don't even know what the rest of this video has, but we're just we're just gonna go with the flow and you guys are just gonna come with me.
y'all so we just left the gym but we're hungry so we're probably gonna go to Panera or somewhere sit down eat a little bit work a little bit um probably get some more content just for later on in the week or next week and then later on tonight i'm going to bible study at my church um he's coming to go to bible study and then i think that's it for the day but we'll see you guys when we get to panera so bad all right drink your drink We're at Panera Red, and I'm eating. So after I eat, I will get back to you guys. And he obviously wants me to do my TikTok dance for y'all, so I'm gonna just do it. Hey, it ain't for me. It's it's for them. And I'm still here outside, front line, south side. I've been losing friends and finding peace. Honestly, that sound like a fair trade to me. Can you smile for the picture? I need to know you were thinking. Can you smile for the picture? I need to know you were thinking. Can you smile for the picture? I'm exhausted, I'm not even gonna lie. I am exhausted. And we're going to Bible study at 7. It is 3.37. Bible study doesn't start until yeah, 7. it's the perfect time to get work done. I know. Well, anyways, we're getting some work done. And I will show y'all when we get to the church. But right now, we're just working, editing, all that. So I'm back after an extremely long day of just packaging orders, shipping orders, working out at the gym, getting some content, editing the content, working, like it's just been in a long day. But this is the day in the life of a new, I'm actually new, a new full time, I was about to say influencer, entrepreneur today was my first day and I feel like it was extremely productive like I didn't stay home and just rest I got a lot of work done and I am extremely proud of myself I am but um, I'm back home Bible study was pushed to online because the weather is terrible it's raining and it's just disgusting outside so um, Bible study is in about 30 minutes so I'm just gonna do a montage of me doing that and then I will probably hang with family talk to my man talk to my friends whatever um but before i go to sleep i like to journal in my 90 day self discovery journal so i'm gonna show you guys that if you want one be sure to head to phenomenallypresent.com and get you one you don't want to miss out i promise you like this is a time where people are discovering themselves learning their likes their dislikes their fears their triggers how to deal with friends all of that and journaling is extremely important so if you don't have a journal i highly recommend you to buy my 90 day self-discovery journal you can also look at our instagram at phenomenally present i'll put it in the description box below but make sure to check that out and get you one um verse 16 though says this and it closes out with the rest of it. it says these people are grumblers and complainers living only to satisfy their desires they brag loudly about themselves and they flatter others to get what they want but you my dear friends must remember what the apostles of our lord jesus christ said they told you that in the last times there would be scoffers whose purpose in life is to satisfy their ungodly desires. Verse number, we got 10. It said that these people scoff at things they don't understand like unthinking animals. They do whatever their instincts tell them. Which okay. said that Holy Spirit protects us from our instincts. Mm -hmm. Think about what things you were going to do instinctively. <laughs> you were going to cut somebody out instinctively 
you would have smoked like something instinctively. You would have went all the way off instinctively. <laughs> you would have stole something if you didn't have it instinctively. You would have quit instinctively. But because you are filled with the Holy Spirit, you didn't do what your instincts tell you to do. Mm. Hey, y'all. It's me again. <laughs> I just got off a of Bible study. It was so good. What time is it? Where's my phone? I don't even know where my phone Oh, Found it. It is 922, y'all. Is it going to show? Yeah, it's 9.22, you know, I'm a grandma, so I'm about to just journal, probably watch something until I fall asleep. I don't know, but I'm feeling tired because I just ate and it hit the spot and I have the itis. But anyways, um, yeah, I just got a Bible study. It was so, so, so good. As you guys can hear some of it in the last clip. But I'm just going to take you guys with me through journaling and then that's going to be the day in the life of a full-time entrepreneur. Today's prompt is balance. How can I focus on maintaining a balanced life? I want to thank you guys so much for sticking with me this entire video and watching this video of the day in the life of a full-time entrepreneur. If you want to buy a 90 day self discovery journal, you can head to my website at phenomenallypresent.com. We have some that are selling for $30. There is a shipping price. The price is $5 flat and we are shipping only within the US. So if you see this and you would like to get you one, feel free to head to my website. There's my story on there, um, all the details about the product and all of that. And you can also leave a review. So if you would like to head there and do that, that would be greatly appreciated. But I appreciate you guys so much for watching this video and I look forward to seeing you guys soon.